All right, let's stay on tech here. Hewlett Packard Enterprise has just made a big change in how businesses consume the power of supercomputers. Let's talk more about that with Peter Ongaro, who is HPE's general manager of high performance compute, computing and mission critical solutions. Hi, Peter. Good to uh, good to see you today. So, uh, take us through this change in, in your business model here. So you're asking enterprises or, or customers now to pay as you go or pay for, for consumption. I'm also seeing this start to emerge throughout uh, big tech more broadly. Why did you make this change and what does it mean to your business? business? Yeah, the, thanks for having me. And you know, what we're seeing is organizations large and small with this massive growth of data that we've all been talking about and, and new ways to compute on it, such as AI or digital transformation. And what we announced just yesterday is that we're bringing our market leading high performance computing or HPC solutions, you know, the same type of technologies that you find in some of the largest supercomputers in the world. And we're bringing that as fully managed services through our cloud services platform we call HP GreenLake. So now everyone from Fortune 500 companies to startups can easily adopt and run these technologies to do amazing things with their data faster than ever before. Um, you know, the same types of applications that are used on some of the largest research supercomputers in the world are also used at auto manufacturers, for instance, just to look at car safety, crashing cars together and understand how to protect people in that environment. That same application is also used in small businesses, like a, a small golf club manufacturer, because that same application is very similar to hitting a, a golf ball with your driver. Uh, although that hasn't improved my golf game much, it just shows the need of using these high performance computing technologies in smaller environments and HPC, HPE GreenLake brings that to customers. So, Peter, we're basically talking about, I guess I'm hearing this as like the democratization of supercomputing, if that's uh, maybe a way to think about it. So where where is supercomputing at then? Because I'm I'm presuming there is still a, a level of complexity that goes kind of beyond this. And you think about things like autonomous driving and, you know, AI and, and the, the really big picture stuff that technologists talk about. How far advanced is that relative to um, what is now a solution that, uh, again, as you mentioned, if I start a small business tomorrow, I can get a credit card and, and start using some of these applications? Yeah, this is the exciting part of technology, really. I, the, the supercomputing technology today and what we're building for the next generation of supercomputer that we call exascale systems. So think about systems that are an order of magnitude faster than the fastest supercomputers on the planet today that we'll, we'll be delivering to customers starting next year uh, is really exciting and able to handle these new applications and this, this growth of data that we're talking about. And so what's exciting is how, how do we take that same technology that these big research institutions that, you know, understand how to use it and have the skills and the facilities to take advantage of it, how do we take those same technologies down and, and, and give that to everyone, as you said, democratize the technologies? And, and that's really what we're doing with, uh, with GreenLake is to be able to do that in a fully managed cloud services environment for customers, pay as you go, and, and allow the even smallest companies to have the access to the same technologies that these immense research institutions have. And then the other thing that we're seeing in the market is that many applications just are struggling to go to the cloud. So um, their size, their scale, their complexity of data, uh, so, you know, bringing a cloud to the application or to the customer is, is what GreenLake is all about. Pete, I, before we let you go, I do want to get your thoughts on tech more broadly. Some of these valuations on these on these new tech IPOs coming to market, uh, an Airbnb or DoorDash, you name it, really, uh, they're red hot. Are investors just missing something? Is there that much innovation happening right now in Silicon Valley? Is this, is this game changing stuff happening and, and it's just being underestimated by, by investors more broadly? You know, I think that there's uh, well, there's a lot of hype in the market, of course, around some of these uh, new companies and new technologies, uh, which is exciting. But these technologies are fundamentally changing uh, the world. We're super excited at HPE. We're the market leader in high performance computing, 37% market share. And what we're seeing is that these technologies all of a sudden now can be applied to so many different uh, areas and so many different companies. And so you see companies starting up, taking advantage of these 
new technologies, just like you mentioned. Um, and so we think we're in a really good position to take advantage of that. And we think as a company, uh, we'll be able to really uh, grow with the market as, uh, as these technologies come to fruition. What a year indeed. All right, we'll leave it there. Peter Ungaro, HPE General Manager of High Performance Computing and Mission Critical Solutions. Good to speak with you. Have a good weekend. Thank you.